down eight nothing earlier. What's what's the mindset there? You know, I, I mean, you don't want to quit, obviously, yeah. after two, two innings there. Uh, just chop, just chop away at him. I mean, play small ball. Try to get one run, one run at a time. I mean, just have just have faith in our pitchers, have faith in our in our hitters, and just don't quit. So. It seemed like Coach Mack pulled you guys together after those first couple innings. What, what was that message from Coach like in the dugout? He's just like, this. We gotta tough it out. We gotta be tough right here. Just gotta have good at bats. Keep putting up zeros and just keep fighting. So. What's, I mean, what's that say about you guys when you face such a huge deficit mm-hmm. and you're able to, you know, come together offensively yeah. to overcome that as well as the pitching? Yeah, I mean, this this group's awesome. I mean, we're together. You, you, you can't you can't pout if you're you're getting out. You can't pout if you have a bad inning. You gotta trust trust the next guy up. So I mean, that, that's just a big motto. This team's just trust the next guy and just staying focused throughout the whole game. You had a couple guys on base. You know, obviously you win that big five-run inning and that huge single to score the, the tying runs. Mm-hmm. Just your thoughts at that moment? Um, I'm just I'm trying to pick up Logan right there. I mean, we're we're a team, so hitting's contagious. I think we got a couple hits in a row before that. I mean, I, I was just trying to put together a good at bat for the team. Heading into this series, it seemed like the offense has been a little bit inconsistent at times. But what's been the key to you guys seemingly getting back on track in this series? Just being, just being tough outs, just trying to trying to get our pitch to hit. Um, but yet again, I mean, just trying to be a tough tough out every every single time we step to the plate. When you see a guy like Riley come out of the pen, a guy who started the you know the beginning of the season, and throw together the four innings like yeah. he did, what's that do for you guys defensively? Oh my gosh, it's so easy playing behind Riley. You know, you know, you, you got to stay locked in. He's going to get a bunch of ground balls. And obviously the strikeouts will come too, but it's awesome. I mean, he's just pounding the ball in the zone, so he's locked in right now. Appreciate it.